I play something like a nutshell uh, in E minor. Those are the three chords that we're looking at. It's an uh, E flat minor, a D flat, and a B. And if you think about the root note for those guys, there's your E flat, right? Down to the uh, down to the D flat is a whole step, and down to the B is another another whole step. So you basically have three chords that are separated by uh, whole steps, whole steps apart. So you can play uh, pentatonic and blues uh, chords over the top of that if you want to, and I'll show you how you might practice something like that. So starting at the E flat. Now you can play that D flat like so uh, by moving to the fourth position. But check this out, your bar is already there. And most of the notes are here on the sixth fret. So you could either play like so, or like so. Where I'm duplicating the bar uh, shape for the B and also for the D flat. So it doesn't matter, either way is fine. The idea here is is to have your um, your uh, finger, your first finger, in the right in the right position to play the lowest notes that you want to. So let's see how that might work for us. Now here I am at the B, and I'm going to play the uh, the scale notes here. Uh, and that is a five, six, one, two, three, five, six, one, two flat three, three, five, and six. Now the minor chord uh, shape is a little bit different. So here's a uh, uh, nice and slow for us. Starting and ending on the one, two, just to make things a little simpler. So again, E flat to the D flat to the B, right? So I'm going to play, uh, looking at the chart here, I'm going to play my five, six, one, two, three, then five, six, one, two, flat three, three, then five and six again. And that sounds like this. Back down to the one. I'm still at my B, and so the, the last note that I want to play, of course, is my B because that's the uh, that's the root. That's the, that's what that's my target right there. So. Now to the E flat, right? So I really kind of want to end up on the E flat there. Let's see if I can do that. Ah, there it is. There's my E flat. So have some fun with that. So uh, working the scale, uh, don't worry so much about the D flat because it's in between. You're only sitting on it for a minute. You could work it in, but it would be more challenging. Since you're on the E flat minor and the B for longer. Uh, so a place for a scale right here. And then here. Nice and slow, go nice and slow for yourself. I would be very uh, surprised if you could do it at that speed. Just give yourself a chance to learn. Give your fingers a chance to sort of figure out where they're supposed to go at. Okay, enjoy.